November 23rd to December 12th, 2009. 20 days, four deaths. Along this stretch of Route 724, two Pottsgrove High School students were killed in a car crash on November 23rd. They were among five passengers in a car with a teen driver. Less than three weeks later, on December 12th, on a similar stretch of Route 100, two girls from Pottstown High School were killed. Again, they were among five passengers in a car with a teen driver. I'm Nancy March. I'm the editor of The Mercury, and I'm also a parent in this community. And as a parent and as the editor, I believe that we need to do more as a community to address these tragedies and numbers that are killing our young people. And you know, when you hear about a crash, you, you, you think about with that parent, this is what I think. I think, like, when K Ron died, I think that you, you bring, um, you have active memories like, oh, my, my baby, you know, it's like you, all, all you can see is your little baby that you had, and then all of a sudden your little baby's gone. You know what I mean? And I think that kids need to. Tell their parents everywhere they're going. You know, it might not. It might seem like something minor, but just knowing where your child is at all time. Large effect on our building. Very from a standpoint of uh, tragedy, trauma, um, and we're not sure how we have moved on yet, and if we have. And it's tough for these guys because, um, you know, as adults, we don't know how to handle, you know, death. Um, so for these guys, it's very difficult is how serious it is like you know everybody, when you're 16 you're supposed to get your license and like parents like you beg your parents for a car but you know it's a it's a very serious thing like it it didn't hit me until I had like my brothers in my car and I was like my, I have my brother's lives in my hands you know what I mean like it's it's a serious thing and I don't think I think it's hard for um not necessarily just teenagers but I think people in general to realize like how serious the severity of driving and having the responsibility of other people lives in in your hands and I think it's uh, it's taken for granted. Car crashes are the leading cause of death for teenagers in the United States. Last year more than 3,500 teenagers were killed on highways in the country. In Pennsylvania the toll is even higher than the national average. Pennsylvania is in the bottom 10 of states in this country for laws that protect our children from, from tragedies on highways. As parents, we need to do more to change that. As a community, we need to do more to change that. Talk to your kids, show them these pictures, read these stories with them, show them these kinds of videos, and talk about the dangers that happen when they get behind the wheel of a car. And as a community, write to your legislators, advocate for changes in the law. This can save lives.